What's up? My name is Rich. This is Tony. We're back reviewing websites. Back at it again. They kept asking for it. So, I mean, we got to give it to them, right? They All right, we got to give it to them. So, the first one, we made a video we asked on Instagram. Make sure you follow both of us on Instagram. It's down here somewhere. But that's where we ask you to submit your brand website. And we do our best to get to as many as we can. So, I got the first one pulled up. Okay. Poweredbylove.com. What you think? Okay, so the first thing that I get when I'm looking at this website, Power by Love, is I don't know exactly what I'm looking at. It says like Power by Love and that's it. It has like a picture, but I don't really know what they're selling. Um, I even see that they have a sale going on, but like the first thing should be what the site is. So like right. when people see that hero banner or that slideshow, mm -hmm. it needs to like introduce the brand. Yeah, so I, I like the picture, but I think they could have like branded well if that was all we were seeing and mm -hmm. it was just say like home or something. Yeah, and then it's like, does it scroll down some? Yep, there's a lot of white space going oh, on. Oh yeah, too much negative space for sure. Like they can somehow move that up or may even change the color of the background because their shirts are white too. Right. So how do we create that contrast so that the shirts pop out? Right, okay, so their pricing is kind of strong. I'm thinking they're doing print on demand. Mm -hmm. What do you think? Uh, like you said, it could even be vinyl because it's just super yeah, it straight and simple. But the pricing could be a little bit high for what it is because yeah. it doesn't really give that much. It's mm -hmm. just kind of like powered by love. So you got the picture at the top. So if you don't really have designs, you got to sell me to why I should join this campaign. Right. Like why should I wear power by love? That needs to be shown on the site. Right. So in my opinion, I think if you're selling just like the brand logo a lot, you got to pretty much tell the story like up top, mm -hmm. be real descriptive of it. Like you said, you got to sell on like the actual message and actual message t-shirts do do well. But for something like this, I honestly would try to find a way to like sell a low price point so people mm -hmm. fall in love with the brand yeah and then have some greater designs for like a higher price yeah i would invest in a new website also especially if they want to go further just because it looks free made it looks like they made it right and they probably think that it's fine and no like hate to them but especially if you, it's not ad ready at all you right. can't even run ads to this right so this heart's cool, but yeah, we're, we're already done here. Yeah. So I think we just, it, it's still very square one. Mm -hmm. uh, it kind of depends where you're at. So um, if you're just starting off, cool, it's a good mm -hmm. start. But if like you've had this for like a few months now and yeah. you've been watching the channel, it kind of irritates me. Cause yeah, then yeah. it's like, you, you put it together and you're like, uh, it doesn't work and then you don't go back. They don't even got the logo at the top. They just got the chest, <laughs> yeah. you know what I'm saying? So I work on that as well. All right, so we're just gonna go on to the <clears> next one. Okay, let's see who we got. All right, so I actually know this one. Never ever MIA. So, okay. Uh, first thoughts. First thoughts is it looks somewhat cool that would make me start going down because I mm -hmm. see like a picture, but I can't truly see the picture. Mm -hmm. The logo looks abstract, so I would scroll down, but maybe give us a little bit more in right. the beginning because sometimes with these themes, the pictures be bigger than what's allowed, and what that does is it kind of just hides the that initial introduction, that first impression. All right. All right, so let's see. Like that. Oh, that's a better picture. Face. That should yes. be the first picture. Okay. That that's, one's kind of hard to tell. What yeah, it I don't know what that is. Black. But yeah, um, I think so. Even that one works. Mm -hmm. I would say I think that's I, a way better picture right yeah. there. So I know some people always just like look at it on mobile too. Mm -hmm. So that might be a thing. True. All right, so we got some of their products. Cooler products for sure. I definitely like the uh, streetwear appeal, the aesthetic to it. But honestly, even if it started with something like that versus the slideshow, mm -hmm. or just encompass that, it looks better. But like you said, I think he designed for mobile, yeah. you know, and left the desktop people out. And most people do shop on mobile, so I understand that. But you gotta think your buyers are coming from all over the place, especially if you're targeting actual Facebook ads. Right. I also don't see any products on the home page. I'm I'm kind of a fan of like products on yeah, the home same. page. Yeah, same. There's so, not a lot of call to action. Right. It doesn't really make you feel like you need to like shop. So if the home page is your landing page and that's directly where you're at, you kind of you know you still have the opportunity to exit out instead yeah. of like clicking on something. Right. So real quick, real quick. Let's see. What I'm we just got. gonna click on the product. All right. So here we are. Products. Yeah, probably is good for mobile. It's not bad on desktop either though. I do like that. You know his designs are really cool like i could definitely see those with like an outfit and they're not extreme they're not cheap but they're not extremely expensive for like the market that he's going for so i could like that as well okay can you do a quick 
comparison for me. So this this website also mm -hmm. has like a lot of white space, a lot of negative yeah. space. But why does this one look better than the previous one? Even though that one looks better because the designs on his shirt look better. It's kind of it gives me a hype beast feel. You know what I mean? And a lot of times they're like that. I personally would go for bigger images just to make people say like, wow, because it's easy when your images are small should just skip it but i think they designed for mobile like we keep gotcha, saying gotcha. so it probably looks better on mobile all right so uh we haven't done this in a while what about one out of ten what do you think uh, <laughs> one out of ten i'm gonna give it a strong 5.5 .5. okay just because i feel like where he's going with the brand it could go so much harder right so i think i think um, so too i think start. i like the products just like the website needs some work yeah for sure all right let's go on to another one Yo, what's up? Did I interrupt you? I'm sorry, but we gotta give a special thanks and shout out to our sponsor for this video, which is Zyro. Let's go. All right, so Zyro is a website builder, very easy to use, drag and drop editing, and it's literally the cheapest in the market. I mean, check out these prices and make sure you use my discount code below, Hustle Ninjas, to get a crazy good discount because i mean you really can't beat these prices three dollars a month if you're building your website whether it's ecom or if you need a simple website for your personal brand then you can use zyro so they have multiple easy ways to create a website you can use your own template or you do an ai website generator so i can click generate website and it's pretty much going to cater the website to me easily so i don't even have to pick a website so right here i type in clothing store this is how i want my buttons to look with a curved look or just a solid button, pick my colorway, and then whatever text style that I would like. And now I click on all of the features that I would like to be on my website. So I click gallery, online store, of course, because I'm selling online, slideshow, contact form. I'm gonna take the contact form off. Instagram feed is pretty cool. Video, click continue, and it's gonna generate my website. It's really that easy. Now they give me three options to choose from. And remember, I can still move this around whichever way that I would like. So I'm gonna click on this first one right here. And now check it out, a beautiful website. All I gotta do is change all the photos to my own type of content and I'm pretty much good to go. And this is cool right here because it's integrated with Instagram. All I gotta do is connect my Instagram account and it's gonna populate my feed. So my clothing brand website, type it in right here and it'll be connected and also check it out they make it very easy to adapt to mobiles so all i do is click on this little mobile button right here and check it out this is going to be how it looks on mobile it looks awesome except for this right here all i got to do is change the actual background picture and i'm pretty good to go so this is an awesome website builder for a very friendly price so remember if you want to use zyro you can get up to 72 percent off plus three extra months free with all yearly plans whenever you use my link. So link down below or use Hustle Ninjas and Zyro is yours for your creative use. All right, so make sure you check out Zyro. Let's get back to the video. All right, so this is uh, moneylords.com. Okay, this one from the top, I'm already like loving it because let's close that little join us. The join us is cool, it looks professional. Okay. I'm liking the video because it's moving, it's highly produced, so now, what Money Lords is doing is it's making me be like, dang, I need to know more about Money Lords and it's making me feel cool. Okay. So I'm getting that emotional feel off of their brand voice. Okay. Let's scroll down. The okay, I pictures. like this. Yeah, it's dope. Love the big pictures. The shirts are cool, I like the oversizedness. They invested in professional photography. So like from the first website that we looked at versus this, this is why I say invest in a professional website right. versus just like, oh, he's hating or it costs money, but now you're gonna get that money back. Right. You right. know what I mean? Because I almost would wanna buy something off of this because it looks cool, you know? Right. Alright. So yep. I'ma give him a I'ma give him a I'm gonna give him a ten. A ten? I'm gonna give him a ten. Dang. I'm gonna a ten. Okay. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and go on to the next one since yeah. this is already ten. Alright, so here we are. This is uh Norm, Normex, Normex. Okay, Normex shop. All right, so I would work on this little pop up a little bit. Just give it, you know. What already bothers me is just like how the text is laid out. Subscribe to our shop, and then not everything is capitalized. Yeah. So just little things like. And that. the pop up doesn't. It's an instant X. It doesn't really versus the other pop up how it had the brand in there. Yeah. It's like let me just get to the site. You know. <laughs> so. All right. So this is the website. Okay. Um. 
when I look at this side and the other side, it's like I see where they were going. I get you. You know, but it didn't execute properly. So this is a kind of a site where they did invest into their site, but the pictures, it's like they got the white background, so I know they took them in a shop, but they could have given more emphasis to them. I feel like they're just kind of like pasted on there. Yeah, I see what you, you know mean. What With the uh, previous one, it was uh, Money Lords. You can mm -hmm. kind of already get a feel of like, oh, what the brand means with mm -hmm. the video and the description. Yeah. Right here, I'm, I'm still not too sure of like what Normex means. Yeah, like it kind of reminds like it could be for like people who are getting over like rehab addiction because I'm seeing a survivor, uh -huh. I'm seeing mental limits, we have none. Um, you know, against all odds. But like you said, I don't exactly know who they're targeting or whatever. And right. now we're going more into with these shirts, just branded shirts. Okay. Um, but yeah, not bad, but definitely could use more work to get it to like a professional yeah. side. And also, I'm very big on like little things. Mm -hmm. Like just like how this is missing a space. Yeah, so yeah, yeah, just like, yeah. And a lot of times people, like I said, they keep making stuff just for mobile. Mm -hmm. And it's like, yeah, you may have 80% on mobile, but that's still 20% yeah. that may be on desktop. And then you cannot be maximizing to them. Right. Almost, you know. All right, let's go ahead and shoot on to another one. Let's go. Shirt, shirt masters, shirt okay. masters. I already like it. You like in it? In the sense of uh, <laughs> the top could use some work for yes, sure because it's a space. lot of negative right. space. I just like the the background picture because it's not like they're just squares. I can see it like overlaying. Yeah, I like the color. And then I also, it just kind of gravitates you from the beginning. Okay, this is definitely not English. Yeah, but then it gets kind of <laughs> weird as we scroll down. Like the <laughs> yeah. top was cool and then now it goes to like, it don't even look right. like it's a real website. It kind of like, just yeah. looks like like a deco network or ink soft. Yeah, so that's, to a that's site. The, the issue that I have with it. I didn't know if this was a printer mm -hmm. or and I didn't, I didn't know if this was like, you know, a direct to consumer space. I didn't know if they're just like. Yeah, because it does look like you're about to click on it and like a design builder is going to pop up or something. Yeah, it doesn't look like an actual e-commerce site. So, but I'm thinking it's mixture too because they still have the contact here. Mm -hmm. They just have their own products as well. Yeah. Um, it might help. Let me see this back here, this Parallax, Where we at? this background image. Uh huh. Yeah. See, they look like they designed for you. It doesn't look like an e-commerce site. Yeah. Okay. So, uh, I don't even know how to rate this product. Yeah, me either. Honestly. All right. So on to the next one. And this one is called Crazed Collection. Okay, so I like it. It's giving me a hype beast feel again. It's cool. <laughs> it's got like a intro to the site. So the logo's cool enough to let's see what's behind it. All right, so I see a lot of coming soon, so I don't know what's up with that. I'm yeah, because see, that confused me because I yeah. thought we had to click the logo to get into the site. Right, but, but we're now, already scrolling down. Yeah. All right, so I see a lot of coming soon, which is everything's out of stock, and then we're already done. So you can kind of almost get towards like the high beast feel but i think it's like the execution was a little off yeah for sure like you gotta watch out with like the coming soon you gotta put it in one place mm -hmm. or you kind of gotta put the t-shirt on there and say it's out of stock and then sign up for an email you know yeah exactly so i mean even though it's down there you kind of want it with like the actual product yeah but the product gotta be fired for yeah the hat's kind of cool though the, the fire hat? panel yeah. I'm not mad at it so the, the signature the, on the, the side uh the embroidery on the side always helps out mm-hmm well, super that. large image. Um, the only thing too is like whenever you save images for web, mm -hmm. you gotta actually go on like Photoshop and click save for web. Yeah. That way you can lower the quality. And yeah. I'm pretty sure like their their uh, their load time for mobile might. Yeah, it might be a little long. Yeah. No. Cool hat though. All right, so uh, we'll do one more. One more. We'll close yeah, I want one more. We'll, we'll do, do one, one more. more. All right, one, one more. more. Let's see. All right. All right, so this one is called Cruise Gang not store, but I don't even see the anything logo. at the top. <laughs> is this the logo? Yes, I suppose that's the logo. Okay. All right, Cruise Gang dot store. It's a luxury streetwear, so I can kind of see where it's almost like Ed Hardy-ish. If like I clicked on it and if this was rhinestone, mm. I would see how it's kind of luxury. But I think it's like maybe glitter. Oh, okay. I see. It what scares it me what the actual product would look like. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I think something like that, yeah. if it's gonna be specialty, they should like show the specialty part of it. Right, so if you have a luxury brand, you really gotta step it up and not like mm -hmm. just halfway in. This would only work if you already are like super high profile. Like if Travis Scott dropped this, it's oh, fine. Yeah. Nobody cares, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah. But when you need the conversions and the sales, you know what I'm saying, to support the business, 
then it's like we gotta add more call to actions. Right. For sure. The pictures are really small. I don't like that. I really like that other site that had the big pictures, the Lord site. Uh -huh. So I think for anybody watching this video, we should um, take after that site. Right. Okay. So I like old English font for like mm -hmm. particular things, just not for like you know buns I'm about to click on because I'm gonna yeah. have a hard time reading it. Yeah, exactly. But other than that, I think it's headed in a okay direction. It just needs like better execution. So to end it, let's let you, let's let you give the score. What are you gonna score? On? Score on this one? Ooh. If I could see that, <laughs> if I could see that product in person, and mm -hmm. if it was like look like luxury, and yeah. they had an actual photo of it, I feel like the product could almost be like a ten, you know? Yeah. But for the website itself, I'm I'm like at a five or something. At a five. Yeah. Cool. I can see that. Well, I hope y'all enjoyed this segment of the video. Yeah. Let us know if y'all want a part two. See y'all next time. All right. All right. Hey, Hustle Ninja, thanks for watching. Remember, if you want to support the channel and have the chance to win a giveaway to help your clothing brand, be sure to check out OnlyNinjas.com. Also, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And stay hustling.